hi everyone welcome to my channel in this video we are discussing about uh, how to integrate uh, Prometheus Grafana with Jenkins so in the previous sessions we will see how to integrate with uh, docker and uh, node exporter with Prometheus Grafana in this session we will discuss uh, how to integrate with Jenkins so uh, how to uh, see the jobs on the Jenkins server what are the jobs are running those details uh, we will discuss and uh, so let's install the Jenkins on the node build server so I have this server just connected docker ps I think only node exporter is running exporter so to install Jenkins we need Java required so Java is not there in this mission. Let me install Java first. So I'm installing Java 11. So we can install uh, Jenkins many ways. So I'm going with the repository. So let's wait for uh, to install the Java. Let's duplicate. I haven't updated uh, this server, so let's update parallelly. App to get update iPhone Y. Now, if you check Java iPhone version. I think still it is not been installed. Let me try to install Java 8. So if you check Java version now, so Java 8 is installed. To install the Jenkins Java 8 also fine. So for now, in the Ubuntu, we need to update it and uh, install the Java, add the repository to the key system. So I'm just adding the Jenkins repository. Now adding the Debian package. apt install Jenkins iPhone Y so first we will update that after adding the repository Now it is installing the Jenkins. Once installed, uh, we need to start the Jenkins. So system CTL. Or Jenkins now if you check the status so it is up and running 
the Jenkins will running on port 8080 default. Take the public IP of the build server and uh, take 8080 port. Now it will be asked the initial admin password. So just uh, take the initial admin password from the location cat. So this is the password. Take the password. And uh, install the suggested plugins. So once Jenkins is up and running, right? We need to add the. We need to create the first admin user. So I'm giving username admin password admin one two three. Admin one two three. I'm giving full name admin. Thing admin. Gmail dot com. I'm giving some sample name. Save and continue. So save and finish. Start the Jenkins. So once it is done, right? So we need to be go to manage Jenkins, manage plugins. So you just need to add the Prometheus metrics plugin. So if you check Prometheus metrics plugin in the installed one, we it doesn't have. Available. Okay, so you just need to go to available. You have to search Prometheus metrics. You need to be install this plugin. Okay, so download now and install after restart. This plugin required to restart uh, your Jenkins once it should be installed. At. So restart. So it, the Jenkins will be restarted automatically. So once it should be restarted, so you just need to be give slash Prometheus. It should be automatically get the list of uh, jobs, all the details. So I'm giving username admin admin one two three. To see the output of uh, plugin URL, so after that. You just need to give slash Prometheus. Support 88, it will be display the list of plugins, servers, everything. So let's wait for a minute and we'll see. Let's check that plugin installed successfully or not. Manage Jenkins, manage plugins. Installed. Let's search with this Prometheus. Prometheus plugin, Prometheus metrics.
plugin is not installed successfully that's the reason it is not able to get that the details so let's wait and let install one more time prometheus i think it is installed The uh, Prometheus Matrix plugin is installed successfully. It should come. Yeah, see, now it should be getting the related uh, VM related and the plugin related memory, CPU, all that uh, details. It should be get up. Okay, we need to integrate it with the Grafana these details. So to see this uh, scrap in scrap details, so we need to be uh, add the server into the Prometheus.ml file. Okay. So now go to Prometheus server VA etc slash Prometheus Prometheus dot YML. So you just need to add the entry here. So you just need to add the server details. Oh. job name should be Jenkins copy paste it and uh, you just need to give the private IP, IP of uh, your build server so I'm taking this one copy this So I saved this one. So once I hit, have saved, I just need to be restarted. Grab Prometheus. So the command is kill F and hub process. So now Docker logs fnf my prom so it should be loaded configuration file prometheus successfully so if you restart recheck right if you go to the targets now it should be added jenkins up and running okay node exporter c advisor prometheus these are the different uh, sources service discovery c advisor jenkins node exporter prometheus okay all are up and running here now you just need to be integrated with grafana so you just need to go to import so i am saving the current dashboard save the dashboard now to integrate jenkins with uh, Prometheus Grafana, the dashboard number is 306. Okay, so if you give 306, it's loaded. So you can able to see the list of uh, jobs, all the details, the scrap interval, five seconds, last five minutes, the time interval. This is the JVM free memory, JVM uptime, Jenkins health, Jenkins uh, failed plugins, okay, node offlines. Currently, we don't have anything. So, if you try to create any sample job, so we can able to see that details as well. New item, pipeline, first job. First demo, I'm going with pipeline. Pipeline. Hello world. Apply, save. Build now. It's 
so job is successfully done if you see console output the load message successfully finished this job if you go to the grafana and uh, if you refresh after 5 seconds the free space memory should be updated okay and the last 5 minutes the data should be here so if you added uh, one more job so the free space memory will be occupy something job queues okay like this jenkins uh, executor in use jvm up space jvm plugins failed so these are the information about uh, integration with jenkins and prometheus okay if you like the video please share and subscribe thank you